Alrighty guys, uh, it's like 4 or 5 in the morning, I couldn't sleep so I came out and uh, puttered on this, this is a 351 case, uh, that I'm hoping if all goes well we'll have some pretty cool high performance goodies coming for it, um, I gotta find one more case bolt, uh, one of the case bolts the Allen head was stripped out and I had to drive up to work side into it to get it out. Uh, I ain't putting that back in there, but uh, this one's, you know, this one's uh, a stuffed crankcase. It's got case stuffers in it, uh, so this should be pretty. This should be pretty cool. I put new uh, bearings and seals in it, and then in between while I was washing parts, this was the honestly the hardest case I've ever had to to clean up uh, it was horrible it uh, whatever was on it did not want to come off but uh, three hours of washing and uh, it's pretty clean we got some assembly lube uh, all over it the crank rolls pretty good the seals are pretty tight um, it should free up so yeah, this is going to be pretty cool. Uh, in between that, I was playing around with the grinder. Uh, show you the chains. I just grabbed a bunch of junkers. This one is with the adjuster all the way back, the part that holds the chain. Probably going to be real grabby and dull fast. It's wicked sharp though. Uh, that was with the chain tensioner all the way back. This is with it midway. This one is with it in its original. It would be the original max uh, adjustment, I would say, uh, back. But that arm's been milled out, so you can even go a full nut, nuts width further and go even farther back. And I'm just using some junk chains. It feels pretty good and then this is the one I did the other day with it and it's full full back position I have a sneaky suspicion this is probably going to be uh, my uh, favorite type of uh, grind just more versatile. I'll show you what I'm talking about. See this slot adjuster right here? The first one was uh, all the way forward, then I had it in the middle, and then in, into this position, and then see here where it's milled out, I can loosen this up and uh, scoot it back even farther and that's the first chain I did somebody has modified this so they could do that um, which is kind of cool so yeah I don't know I think I'm getting the hang of it but real test to be is when I test out the test out the chains I left oh, let's pull you back up there I left all these angles the same I, all I did was play with this this adjuster and then the height here uh, just so I could get the corner of the tooth back to where I wanted it 
so yeah but I don't know that's what I've been puttering on tonight so um, yeah just take it easy and have a good one